The U.S. Constitution, presented by Citizen Genius. The U.S. Constitution is the document that outlines the United States' form of government. A document called the Articles of Confederation created the U.S.'s first form of government in 1781. By 1787, many founding fathers thought the national government was too weak under the Articles. Therefore, 55 delegates from 12 states attended the Constitutional Convention in Philadelphia to revise the Articles of Confederation. At the convention, the founders decided to discard the Articles of Confederation and write a new document, the U.S. Constitution. After much debate, the Constitutional Convention approved the Constitution on September 17, 1787 and then it was sent to the states to be ratified, or approved. The Constitution became the new framework of government after 9 out of 13 states ratified it, although all 13 eventually did. The new government officially began on March 4, 1789. The Constitution consists of a preamble, 7 articles, 40 signatures, and 27 amendments. Let's examine each individually. The preamble is the introduction to the Constitution. It starts with the phrase, we the people, and goes on to explain the reason for the Constitution. After the preamble, there are seven articles. I'll give a quick summary of each article, and more information will appear on the screen. Pause the video to examine the information. The first three articles establish the three branches of government. The first article describes the legislative branch, the second outlines the executive branch, and the third establishes the judicial branch. Each article includes specific information, such as qualifications to hold office, terms of office, duties, and powers. The fourth article sets guidelines for how the states will relate to each other and to the U.S. government. The fifth article explains how the Constitution can be amended or changed. The sixth article addresses several unrelated issues namely that it establishes the Constitution and U.S. laws as supreme. The seventh article says that the Constitution would take effect when nine out of the 13 states ratified it. There is a passage below Article 7, followed by the signatures of 39 of the delegates. The Secretary of the Constitutional Convention also signed it. The names appear on the screen as they do in the Constitution. To the upper left of the signatures, there is a note clarifying how a few words appear in the document since it was handwritten. Since the Constitution went into effect, changes have been made with the addition of 27 amendments. The first 10 amendments are known as the Bill of Rights. Here are a few examples of the amendments. The First Amendment gives citizens freedom of religion, speech, press, assembly, and petition. The Thirteenth Amendment prohibits slavery. The Nineteenth Amendment gives women the right to vote and the 25th Amendment establishes rules for presidential secession and disability, specifically stating that the vice president will take over for a president who dies, resigns, is removed, or is temporarily unable to fulfill the presidential duties. This has been a short overview of the U.S. Constitution presented by 
Citizen Genius.